Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, <clears throat> excuse me, oh my god, I will be reacting ring to episode 44 of Delicious Party Pretty Cares. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. God, this is really ending next week. Oh my god, it felt so weird. Jesus. Like, bruh, what the fuck? At least you're still fighting, oh, Uncle Mary. Oh. Up here comes the rice balls. Like seeing the this part right there where they ate the the, the freaking <laughs> the only guinea. I was like, what? <laughs> the one time. The one time where we could, we could skip it. The one time. It's okay. I am mad, but the one time. Mm. But seriously not this is ending next week oh my god it feels so weird oh my god i mean because like it, it just also makes um hero gato sky pretty here like more like like it's coming and, and it's more visible and such and that it's like oh hey like knock knock that is coming and such and i'm like dang where did the time go for this season? Like, it, it, this whole year went by fast. And the fact that we are, this is like my, what? This is my last show from winter 2022. And of course, regardless, because of the fact this is a whole year, we all knew this wasn't going to end until next year, of course. Duh. But so, oh my God, I'm sad. <laughs> I'm always sad when pretty care ends. But then the best thing is we always get a new one. And since we are going i feel like okay because we are in the 20th anniversary i feel like we're going to get a lot of good things this year i also feel like we're possibly going to get the crossover episode like we got nagato hopefully and every girl's gonna show up oh my god <laughs> I do love the fact with this final battle between them, we're just getting a good old fashioned, like, just battling out fist match. I mean, like, ooh. Normally, it's like, yes, let's always use the wines and such, but I, I just love how it's just hand to hand combat at times. Mm. Another lucky cat, no!
Even the even the big one? Yeah, there was lucky cats all over that episode. But for others, he also met you. But because you're so blinded by hatred, you don't see that. Mm -mm. Oh, that's not going to work, babes. Bro, even the, the town is ready to kick somebody, even though we are in, we're depressed right now. Oh my god. Even parfait. <laughs> oh, 
I don't know why, but I just got kind of Tokyo Mimi vibes with that. I ain't mad at it. A whole bunch of cats about to come out? Okay, no, just the lucky cats coming back. I mean... <laughs> Oh, damn. The, even the panda? <laughs> oh, you're so gullible. Stupid, but gullible. All the freaking lucky cats. Oh, my God. <laughs> Bruh, if you would have told me the second to last episode for the final battle had to do with Lucky Cats, I would have looked at you like you was nuts. <laughs> but it is pretty here. You never know what you're going to see in the, like, final battle episode. Well, that's not gonna work though. Oh. Well, second to last time. Yeah. Because, you know, the, the final, final episode has to do one last transformation scene for this show. And then me, like, I think, what was it, a couple weeks on Twitter ago? I, I literally, <laughs> and it's always, like, my favorite part for Amane. And when she gets closer to the end of her transformation and we're at, like, the final moments and when she spins... It, it's like the best freaking part. And I'm like, oh my God, I am going to miss seeing this every single week. I'm going to miss seeing all four of these girls all together. I mean, yes, I am excited for the next girls. I'm always excited for the next girls. But at the same time, it hurts leaving the old group. And next week is when I really go in 
on this show and how I felt about it comparing to Tropical Rouge and, you know, as pretty here in a nutshell. And then next, the week after, we're going into the 20th anniversary season of Pretty Care. And that's going to be huge. Like, whole. <laughs> I need to make a thumbnail for it. Fuck. <laughs> I'll probably do that tonight. Oh, I just, it just froze up. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, but he's still here in your memories and in your heart. They're always here with us. The delicious stone sticking over him. Mm -hmm. See, if it was me and my, uh, then at that moment, you take it. You take the stone, you destroy it, boom, he's done for. But you know, we have to wait a couple of months. Okay, I like this song. Is 
This has to be one of the songs the four of them had to sing all together. Quality all up in here. Oh my god. Well, I mean, once again, final battle episode. You gotta go all out. I mean, seriously. Damn, they they really went. Oh my god, everybody looks so freaking good. You know what I thought it was actually going to be? Her, you know, like the 5,000 kilocalorie? I, I thought it would be more than that. That's where we ended it. Okay. All right. I'm not mad at that. I mean, it's a it's a little abrupt. I get it, but of course, I mean, okay, 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 okay. I get it. Yes, because they're going like the the final battle episode and the final episode still have to connect with each other because like typically when you're looking at the final episode okay next week's episode it's usually like a filler type episode that is you know ending everything with the four or five how many of her girls are in together but <coughs> excuse me plus the one little appearance of the new girl and getting ready for the next series okay so final battle wise the quality was top tier like real and it's always like that especially with every other um Pretty care season, especially when you look at how this was done and how um, Tropical Rouge's finale and the fight scenes were. Like, they really went all out. I mean, the, the quality on that was really good. Like, so it was like, yeah, we got to go all in. Even though it ain't the last episode yet, we have to go in. We have to show everybody how good this looks. And they did. It, really, it looked gorgeous I, I mean I might have to like literally crop that and put that on my Twitter and be like damn look at this look at this like this this ish it hit and it hit good like ooh okay please also show her I wonder how she's gonna pop up too That's so mean. That, <laughs> they're like, oh, you want to see her? You want to see Sora? No, you have to wait until next Saturday slash Sunday to see her. Honestly, I cannot wait to see her next week. As a little preview, I mean, because it, it's tradition. I, I, I'm, because, like, I cannot remember, like, if, um... Well, no, because when I was rewatching five, they really didn't do that. So it makes me wonder, like, I, I don't really remember when they started. It had to be at least maybe happiness charges when they started the baton thing and you got to see the next girl. 
and such. Um, but still, it's tradition. And, and honestly, I'm really excited to see her next week. Because, like, I mean, th this is the first time, number one, controversy, that we're going to have a blue cure in the quote-unquote pink cure role being that main character and such and i, I mean because i remember i talked about it when we when we got like the first little initiative um info on it and how i was hella excited and how even now i'm still excited about it and such and i was like this is now changing the game where it's like okay like yeah we're having a blue cure be the leader instead of a pink which is it's very different this and, and as I, I think i said something to one of my friends about it i was like it might turn some people off but i do like the difference i really think that's an interesting idea i feel like if we do if something else happens to where someone is inspired by the next series who who knows where they could go with that and such but seriously going back into this episode i mean it went by pretty quickly the quote the fight the little fight scenes that we got were good i i really enjoyed the hand-to-hand -hand combat and such of what we got um uh, especially going into last week's into this week's and i'm kind of hoping that since next week is the finale um i'm guessing we're not really gonna have anything bad really show up on last time because the evil is defeated that's the biggest thing at the end of the day so it, is it just gonna be us making a big cake for the whole episode is it gonna because how that looks it, it's it is very similar to kid kid is ending kid kid is ending was something very similar to that where um no 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 where we had like a big monster come in the last episode and then eventually curiel comes in um, and all six of them, counting Pecorine as a, as a cure, as a cure, because she is a cure as well, officially, even though it's not canon, um, but everybody came together to defeat the final monster of the show, and then Yell, you know, eventually has, like, a couple more little things with her and Hagutan and such, and they leave, and, yeah, I think it was, like, a big cake monster, I don't really remember, I have to go back and look at the finale and such, um, but I'm kind of getting feels towards that. And so are we getting another cake monster and then eating him? And then next thing you know, Sora comes in, she does her little move and then she's like, okay, bye. Like, you know, hey, thanks for the little like <laughs> introduction. And then, you know, especially, and, and I really hope they do this next week. So Crunchyroll, kind of talking to you right now, please, for the love of God, show the baton toss. You didn't do that last year when it was um, Tropical Rouge going into Delicious Party. And that's what freaked a lot of people out who have Crunchyroll accounts. And they didn't show, or we didn't know if Crunchyroll was, you know, going to start slowly uploading the subs of this show. And so all of us, like, literally freaked out. We're like, oh, okay, now we're going to have to go back to doing what we used to do <laughs> and such. And even me, I was like, oh, God, I'm about to start waiting until Sunday and then probably have it come out on Monday or have it um, possibly wait until Monday for it to come out or watch it on Monday and have it come out on Monday. But, I mean, who really knows now? Um... But as I said a couple of weeks ago, when we were looking at these shows that Crunchyroll um, is getting, I think there were four spots left. And I'm guessing there is only about two to one spots left. And we know that Here It Goes Sky, Pretty Care, is going to be one of them. The biggest thing is we have to wait for them to announce it. So that's the biggest thing that we're going to have to look about the Saturday after. But I mean, yeah, the final battle was very interesting. The quality of the moves, I mean, the, even the, the moment where the girls kind of turned Super Saiyan was very interesting as well. Um, they ate. Everybody ate. Everybody did good. Fantastic. I love how Mary and Cinnamon, you know, also came together. Like, everybody literally came together to defeat our evil final boss. And I love that about this show and such. Like, oh, 10 out of 10. All right, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode 44 of Delicious Party Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday slash maybe even Sunday, but really more Saturday. 
for the final episode and the final thoughts of this show overall when I really, 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 really get knee deep into the characters, the story, and maybe like, yeah, some nitpicking. There will be some nitpicking. Um, Everything else in between. That's all I'll say with the nitpicking and things that, you know, I wanted that we didn't get and such because we're, we're you know ne regardless next week we are going to have a good old time it might be the longest video um i've done i kind of always want to have the finales be the longest video but yeah until then i will see you guys all next time bye